Peace Reflections. You are over here with Tarethia. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the follow button, depending on which platform you are on. Now, we are actually here to talk about signs that you have been hexed. That you could have a little piece of do you believe in magic over your reflection, okay? Now, if you missed part one, definitely go on YouTube and check out their video of the signs of how to tell if someone has did a little do you believe in magic on you, okay? Now, I actually did a quick protection um spell that you can do your self-reflection it's in the last video i uploaded on youtube in the video tab okay so you can definitely check that one out if you need a little protection spell okay now if you need something more in depth definitely um hit me up in my inbox reflection or go to the night school and i'm sure you can find something over there quick and easy that you can do your self-reflection but if you need a little more assistance Torethia is here for you okay now with that being said let's talk about the signs um that you could have a little do you believe in magic over you okay now, the first sign, and this is part two, the first sign is you're unable to find work. In part one, we talked about um, losing your job. All out, out of a sudden, you all of a sudden, you just lost your job. Reflection, you just lost your job. You know you were doing everything that you needed to do on that job. Reflection, okay, they sometimes can't actually target your finances. So, if that's how you make your money, any way you're making your money, whether you're on a job, whether you're an entrepreneur, all of a sudden, you listen, I'm going to have to close this down because it seems like I'm putting more out than I'm putting in. Okay? So, it's like reflection. They will target your finances. So, you're unable to find work. Maybe um, business had been booming all of a sudden everything has slowed down and you know yeah we have seasons to where things do slow down but you're like uh-uh this just slowed down all of a sudden this seems very abnormal it's not a coincidence okay it could be a sign someone is doing magic over your finances all right now you have a lot of unusual misunderstandings <laughs> reflection it seems like everywhere you go people are taking your words out of context everywhere you go it seems like you're just bumping heads with someone reflection okay this is not by coincidence this is by design reflection this person could be in the background doing chaos magic remember it's all types of magic reflection it's just you have to um sometimes figure out what type of magic is actually being done over you all right so they will actually do chaos magic we talked about finance magic now this is chaos magic everywhere you go you seem like a confrontation is being put in front of your way okay so everyone is confronting you with something all right or it seems like you're just coming into misunderstandings everywhere you go shit i went to the gas station it was a misunderstanding i went to the bank it was a misunderstanding shit i called customer service i thought i was gonna have to jump through the phone on them the reflection reflection breathe it could be a little do you believe in magic <laughs> it could be a little chaos energy in the background all right so let's talk about um accidents x this is a big one it, because they mess with electric okay they mess with a lot of electric um devices reflection you even think about scary movies when they you will see the lights flickering in scary movies and everybody like oh it's, it's gonna go down now because the lights start flickering they play with electricity reflection okay so accident problems it seems like you're just having a stream of bad luck all of a sudden okay reflection everywhere you turn saying like everything you touch is just i don't know it's not working reflection it's just not working okay Okay? it could be that um you have a little do you believe in magic over you all right so accident prawns they big on accidents that's the number one right there okay accident prone okay sudden breakups now we touched on this in part one but we're going to go into that a little bit on part two so sudden breakups whether it's a relationship whether it's a marriage okay you get what i'm saying reflection even your side pieces start acting crazy Ooh it's bad when them side pieces start acting crazy I'm just saying I'm just saying reflection it seems like all of a sudden everybody you had plenty reflection and you ain't got number about one and no one tripping too I'm just saying they could be doing a little do you believe in magic could it be somebody in the, you get what I'm saying you ran across the wrong one and they could have you get what I'm saying they could have put a little piece of do you just a little piece not, not all of it but just a piece of do you believe in magic over your reflection that's a key sign right there I be telling people you everybody ain't meant to lay down with everybody they not meant to get on top of you reflection they might not meant to ride you like a roller coaster they're just not okay 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 i'm just saying i'm just saying all right hit the like and subscribe button you up here with Tarethia and we are talking about hit the follow button we are talking about signs you have been hexed reflection you can have a little do you believe in magic on you all right you need to know this is good shit so let's say you are unable to find love not only are they breaking up relationships throwing your side pieces to the side you can't even go get you but no one reflection they it seems it seem like conversations ain't hitting right you get ready to go in the bedroom and 
Nothing won't stand at attention. It's a desert going on. You never had a desert. You get what I'm, you get what I'm saying? Reflection. It could be a piece of do you believe in magic um, playing with your sex life. They do that heavily too, reflection. Now, usually when they do that, that's the ex. That's usually somebody that you have been sexually involved with, okay? Now, I'm just telling you, everybody is not meant to ride you like a roller coaster all right reflection now changes in your finances within the last three months think about your finances in the last three months reflection remember i told you sometimes we have a peak everybody has a season and everybody has a reason but sometimes reflection is that do you believe in magic okay they love to work in the cycle of three six and nines all right so think about three months ago if you think about three months ago reflection Think about the people that you were coming in contact with, okay? Because remember, the magic got to go up, then to come back down, all right? Got to go up, then to come back down, which means it's a time frame for it to go up and come back down and hit them reflection. So, therefore, think about three. Go back in your mind three months ago. You probably don't even remember so, for somebody out there. You probably don't even. I'm, sorry, though, I'm not judging. I'm not judging you but i know you probably don't even remember who you was messing with three months ago okay now just think back though think back think back hard long and hard reflection because this person you may have forgot them but they didn't forget you okay now make sure you join me back for part three well we can go ahead and throw this together okay you can do this and then when we come back for part three you can already be ready okay so in part three we're going to talk about how to narrow this down and figure out because i told you a lot of y'all probably don't remember three months ago who you was in contact with. You don't remember reflection, okay? So, and sometimes it's not sexual. Shit, it could have just been a little fling. It could have been, it could have been on a job. It could have been anywhere reflection, okay? But somebody has penetrated your energy, okay? Or they have someone penetrating your energy. Now, what you want to do, what we're going to talk about more in part three is the list, okay? The list and energy vampires, okay? Vampires of the light is what I like to call them. Vampires of the light because they like to come and steal people light okay so um you actually want to get a list reflection get you a list all right get a piece of paper and on one side you want to write positive and on the next side right next get you a piece of paper and draw a line in the middle hold on let me see if i got um uh, i really hate tearing out my books i really do reflection because i feel like every page has a reason like i hate tearing out them but i want to show you I want to show you, I want to show you, I want to show you. Where's the pen? Where's the pen? Let me find the pen. Let me find the pen. I could have used my board, though. Let's use the board instead. Because I hate tearing out my books. I just hate it. I just do not like that reflection, okay? Uh-oh, that said three. What you over there tearing up? Nothing. I promise I'm not tearing up anything. Okay, so this is your paper. Can you see it? You can't see the board. Okay, I thought it was going to work. It's not. So, we're going to have to use the paper. All right. So, forget it. We'll just use the paper. It's all good. It's all good reflection. Yeah, you can see this. Okay. So, just get the book. And what you want to do is just draw like a line. Okay. That's a permanent mark. I don't want a permanent mark. Okay. You want to draw a line down the center of the page. You can use a pen. I'm just using this so you can see it. But normally, of course, I would use like a pen. So you're going to um, just draw a line down the um, page. Yes, my line is cricket reflection. It, it, it just is. Okay. And on this side, you want to write positive. And on this side, you want to write the negative. Okay. Positive and negative. Okay. Think about all the people that you have came in contact with from the last three months. Whether it was a pinch of positive or a pinch of negative, write it down, reflection. Write it down right here. The people that you came in contact with that in your experience was positive, and the people that you came in contact with in your experience was negative. I don't care if it's the mailman, if it's the dog, if it's the cat. You know what I'm talking about, reflection. All the people that you have came in contact with, no matter if it was big or if it was small, because just because it wasn't a big experience for you, don't mean it wasn't a big experience for them, okay? So, you want to write down all the people from the last three months that you can remember reflection because you remember you're remembering for a reason um and write on one side if they came in contact with you on a positive tip and on this side if it was a negative tip and join me back for part three and i'm gonna tell you how to um figure out who it was okay until next time i shame